32, 33, 35. There's someone here to see you. I'm working out. Hey, Brucey. Nico, one second. Why didn't you tell me it was Nico? Why? Man, women. Man. Women. Yeah. 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 Man, I'm ready for you. I'm ready. I'm ready for fucking anything. Yeah. Are you all right? You seem a little tense. Yeah. Sorry. I'm, I'm just juicing. It makes me a little pent up. Juicing? Yeah. Bull shark testosterone, amigo. Ordered online from Chile. Makes you feel really... well. Hey, be careful, man. I heard that stuff does funny things to your balls. Hey, do I look like I got funny balls to you? <laughs> I haven't considered it. Uh, you sent me a message. What do you want? I want help! I'm losing the plot here! Boss, nah, I'm shitting you, man. Now look, you're really good with that thing. A lot of people are very grateful. Now listen, that guy Lyle had a car worth stealing. He left it in an alleyway off of Yorktown Avenue in Stein. If you pay like last time, no problem. Yeah, of course. Any risks? Nah. Easy as can be. Yeah. Okay, uh, I'll just go yeah. take care of it then. Yeah! No risks, Brucey? Maybe this juicing is fucking with your head. He trying to take Lyle's ride. That's Lyle's ride. I think I need this more than you now.
controlled news from Vizel. You are more like Russia every day. is not an overreaction, although they may look to limited bridge opening soon. Mike Whiteley, Weasel News. Another decapitated and mutilated body turned up last night, this time of a 32-year-old jogger in Alderney. Police confirm we have a serial killer on the loose in the city. He still doesn't have a nickname, although police and the news media are working together to try a few out for size. The keep fit killer and the headhunter currently top the bill. We will keep you posted on this nightmare in our city. Can you find love online? As was reported recently, online dating has overtaken more traditional social interactions as the number one way to meet a mate in the country today. But police yesterday urged caution after a number of disturbing incidents linked to online matchmaking came to light. Along with the usual stalkers, fake photographs, and murders, sociologists warn of a new danger, disillusion-induced depression, when people realize that other people lie on their profiles too, and that not everybody online is a CEO with a power boat and model good looks. As always, check in with weaselnews.com for updates. This is Weasel News. He asked me to bring this by. You're lucky it looks as good as it does. The only thing Brucey thinks is good looking is himself in the mirror. Thanks. <laughs> 